right. The Dark Knight overseen the Dreadnought's construction was most capable. Fortunately for us, he's tending to other matters now. The theft of the Mithril has likely knocked the Empire off balance. I would like you to journey to Bafsk. If we're to stop the Dreadnought from being completed, this may be our only chance. We have a man in Bafsk. He's found a way to reach the Dreadnought. I want you to destroy it. At the very least, find a way to delay its completion. I have full confidence that you and that with you and Minwu on this task, it will be accomplished. Alright. Alright, so let's travel all the way back to Poft. Keep leveling up here, I guess, and fire. Make fire my main fucking black magic spell. Alright. 32 gil, back to pop. But first, some hornets. Okay. Luckily, Bask isn't that far away. Just right around the corner. new armor though that I might buy because I won't take such a huge uh, penalty I should buy um, buy some more you. I wish there was really only just one dude for all this shit. So expensive, dude. Ugh. Pretty sure your shit's all weak. Why does it say this is better? It's fucking not. 1352. Okay. So this one's actually worth it. This is lighter armor. Already have those. Yeah, see, so this way I get the defense boosts. But I don't lose the evasion. Should I buy you one? I don't remember when you leave the party. Mm, 
Ooh, fuck it. I got the money. soldiers here. You know what? I forgot. There's a magic shop here. Bum, 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 bum. Cure status elements temporarily when used to battle. Definitely buying this. Could care less about silence. I don't know what the hell this is. I would assume it's the same thing here, but why would it be temporarily? I'm just gonna do a soon enough. I don't really care about the other three. By all the spells. I would if that was a fucking trophy, but it's not. But honestly, I'm never gonna use these, so soon it is. Alright. General Borgen took command of Thieves and Bafsky a short while ago. Things have gotten much easier than they were under the Dark Knight. It's hard to believe a bumbling idiot like Borgen could become a general in the Imperial Army. Oops, um, you didn't hear that. Uh, Dreadnought? So you're the ones that said to destroy the Dreadnoughts. Don't worry, I'm on your side. There's an entrance to the sewers up ahead. It's a back way leading to the Dreadnought. Be careful. If they see us talking, they may start to get suspicious. So, I'm out of here. Good luck. Okay. Bum, bum. How we doing? Good, good, okay. The Baths Cave. Only new enemy here is a zombie, according to the theme, but we've already fought those. Interesting tune. Um, I don't know if I want to spam this. Well, we can. We're not gonna be in here that long. All right, we got chest up here. Useless long sword. Chest all the way in the bottom. There's a lot of encounters in this fucking cave. Just 
Surprised self destruct is so weak. Okay. This fucking violin come out of nowhere. Stop casting here. Eh, nah, no, fuck it. So I'm gonna run out of MP in case I need it. We still got a lot. do more damage to these guys. I keep forgetting, even if Theory and Diz run out of MP, Minwoo can heal. Drain is complete. I've been working beyond the scenes to see the project through to completion, and your resistance kneel before your Emperor. It's the only alternative left to you. Consider what I've said. When the time comes, we will meet again. <laughs> Looks like you've come all the way from all this way for nothing. See for yourselves. Fucking Borgen. Sick airship, bro. Thing is fucking huge. Well, that's not good. Oops. Destruction everywhere. Now that we're outside, though, let's save. We fight a battle right away. Such a sub brutal. I mean, they don't do damage, but they look very painful. Found a pass in the chest. Okay. Uh, yep, step on this. And we're free. 
take one step and fight a goddamn bird. Alright, well, let's head back to Poft and see how fucked up it got. Airship looks okay. It's a lot of back and forth in this game. This is pretty trashed. Sid and his fucking underling, the only ones here getting drunk still. With the airship, does he want to talk about what happened? Um, try not. What you want to do is blow up that thing's engine. Do that, and you can bring down the whole overgrown tub. Ask about the airship. Airships are powered by Sunfire. I'm sure the Dreadnought's no different. Oh, actually, you know what? Learn. And ask about the Sunfire. Controlling Sunfire is a tricky business. Let the flames get too high, you gotta run away on your hands. The engine will blow sky high. Cool. Alright, we're gonna back to. I'll, um, but before that, let me just rest. And we're gonna head all the way back to Altair. Oh, gotta buy a ticket. Forgetting I can just go in the water here. to leave so I'm taking all your shit many were wounded in the dreadnought attack the shock has even caused my father's condition to take a turn for the worse I hate that my father has to see this he knows he knows his death is near is there nothing you can do Minwu? All those who live must someday die. It is our fate. But you revived us. Still, it is my duty as a white wizard to ease the pain of those who suffer. I shall remain here and devote myself to the care of the wounded. I take my leave of you. The fate of the world rests on you, Furion. Waste no time in destroying the Dreadnought. So long. Men we left the party. Alright. Now... I want to ask her about all this shit. Uh, Dreadnoughts. Many lives were taken in the Dreadnoughts attack. How are we supposed to fight something so terrible? 
Airship, question mark, okay. Oh, sorry, Sunfire. Sunfire is the crest of the kingdom of Kashan. Its flame still burns on the ground floor of Kashan Keep. Scott and Gordon have told me many stories concerning the flame. The finer points of the tale are not known to me. However, I seem to recall that the flame cannot be held in just any torch. Sid told us that we might be able to use the Sunfire to destroy the Dreadnought. Then there's no time to waste. You must depart for Kashan Keep at once. If you hire Sid's airship, the journey should not take long. That leaves only one question. What can you use to bring the Sunfire back? Hmm. Alright. Well, let's go. Let's talk to the king. Oh, not there. That's the tutorial. What the fuck's this dude's room? The king's illness goes far beyond the physical. There's little I can do. So many perish in the Dreadnought's attack. Whoops. Um, Sunfire. Scott sealed the gates of Kashan Keep to protect the Sunfire in the event they were defeated in battle. We'll need the Goddess's Bell to break the seal. Learn Goddess's Bell. What is it? The whereabouts of the Bell are known only to the Kashan Royal Family. Well, that's fantastic. This password thing's kind of annoying too. Uh, Goddess's Bell. I've heard Scott and Gordon mention the bell. The gates of the Kashan Keep open only to the voice of a Kashan or the ringing of that bell. The bell rests deeper than a cavern on the snow plains. It will not be easy to retrieve. So it is your intention to enter the snow cavern? Very well. If only Gordon were here, there would be no need for you to risk such danger. But he isn't, so you must. There is nothing I can do but pray for your success. Joseph knows the snow plains like the back of his hand. He should seek his counsel. You got it. Alright, now we're gonna go all the way back to Salamond. Trio, we're back. This is pirates are money hungry like fucking Sid. Jeez, it's gonna take forever to get one of these spells to fucking 16. Jesus. Well, fire just leveled up. Only 11 levels to go. Uh, where's it going on? I just want to talk to the pirate. Yes, dude. Just give me all the tickets. Joseph, I remember, because I remember Joseph from the party. I don't know if I've ever made it past Joseph. I don't know, obviously. I don't remember who else there is. Two, 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 two. 
All right, Joseph, where you at? Uh, you are in this house. <clears throat> oh, there's your girl, Nelly. Thanks for saving me. You're welcome. Looks like you managed to save my daughter. Thank you. The cowardly Borgen had been threatening Nelly to get to me. Forgive me. If there's anything I can do to help, all you gotta do is ask. All right, got us this bell. The only way to reach the snow cavern is on my snow craft. I keep a snow craft hidden in the mine. It's a blue stone on the first floor that marks the spot. Look beyond the stone and to the right. The secret room's there and the snow craft is inside. I'm sorry I couldn't help you find the mithril, so I want to make up for that by pitching in now. What are we waiting for? Well, let's go. Joseph, join the party. <clears throat> All right. I'm pretty sure Joseph's like a monk. Yep. All right. Could give you better shit, I guess. Your attack's gonna plummet, but your evasion's fucking trash, bro. Jesus. I'm gonna just rest so and get full MP. I don't really have to, but. Wouldn't hurt. Alright, back to Simon Falls we go. I have a feeling, because this area is starting to give me flashbacks now when I first played this game. I think this is actually where I stopped fucking playing. Because Maria would just get fucking one-shotted here. So I'm doing much better than I did back then. So I'm, still, I'm pretty sure back then she still had, because I left her in the back row. So she ended up having fucking still like barely any HP. Yeah, but this, this little walkway looks fucking familiar to me. Now that I come through it again. So I actually didn't make it that far in this game at all. I think that blue crystal sticking out of the, the floor here seemed weird. And it is. Joseph turns a small rock jutting out of the wall, and a passage appears. The snowcraft is in here. You retrieve the snowcraft from the chest. Alright. It's all the chests here. Now we get out of here. to a new enemy here too. A fucking snowman. I wonder if it really looks like a snowman. Bro, dude. I just walked outside. You're gonna give me a fight? Is 
It is nice the uh, character models in two actually are like unique compared to like the first game where they're like kind of bland. Joseph, you're fucking weak, bro. I'm surprised he's not a higher level. The stats for hand-to-hand. Uh, -hand. Alright, we want to go up here to the snow. That's new, that's not listed. Interesting, uh, snowmobile, bro. There's a snowman. Ah, uh, it's just a fu- It wouldn't be funny if it was an actual snowman. Not a fucking Yeti. Should have called them Yetis. Um, I think I'm gonna hold on to my MP. For now. And Freon does pretty good damage. At least sometimes. Wow. I should probably should just use fire against these guys, but. Um, Snowcube actually might take a little while to go through, and I got to be up for work in four hours. So I'm ended here. That's gonna do for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please YouTube, like, share, subscribe, Twitch, give me a follow. And I'll see you guys next time. Until then, late. <laughs>